We have the latest on a story that you saw first on Channel 2 last week. Crews have now begun working on a portion of Bird Island Pier that was damaged in a storm three years ago. A specialty crane was on the water today and began repairing the iconic walkway along Buffalo's waterfront. Channel 2's Rob Hackford has the details. Bird Island Pier is a frequent spot to find ducks, seagulls, heron, and geese. But for the time being, it's also a great place to see a crane. They need calm water in order to do this type of work. A crane that's helping to reset over a dozen 10 to 15 ton concrete blocks that were toppled during a bad storm three years ago. The magnitude of that storm back on Halloween of 2019 um, really was impressive to move that, that sort of weight. The blocks are being reused as they more so slid off the break wall at the base of the pier. It's been there since the late 1800s. That also means this crane's migration will be short. Uh, the crane work uh, what we're seeing today should only be a day, maybe two at most, so uh, the crane will be out of there. The work, like most things on the water, will be weather dependent, so Monday was a good day to be out. Once each block is in place, DPW Commissioner Michael Finn says. And then the crew will be resecuring them uh, to prevent something like this from happening again. Railings will be installed shortly thereafter. The project comes to a cost of $690,000, although 85% of the tab is being picked up by FEMA. It's a beautiful view of downtown uh, that you really can only get unless you're out in the water. So this is, uh, I think, something that a lot of people will be looking forward to and we're happy to get it back open. That'll happen in either late September or early October when Finn says the city hopes to have the pier all fixed up renewing access to a walkway that for a while could only be half enjoyed. In Buffalo, Rob Hackford, Channel 2 News.